guys, it's not quite time for me to put out my cacti collection. It's just not warm enough, particularly at night. We are still experiencing some temperatures down in the 30s. So things are a little uh, chilly around here. It is probably going to warm up in the next couple weeks. So maybe by May 1st, I can put things out. But in the meantime, I'm acclimating some of my cactus um, to getting more fresh air and sunshine. Um, these have all just been in a window, a sunny window. So I thought maybe it would be best if I brought a few of them in and out and get them ready. Um, get them used to things. And the other thing I wanted to do today is to bottom water my large golden barrel cactus. And um, I'll tell you why I thought this was necessary. Um, it, it's got a very small edge around the bottom where water can get in. And I thought, well, even if it rolls down the ridges of the cactus, it's just going to go around the sides and not really give it a full water. So now that I want things to kind of wake up and um, enter their growing season, I thought I'll just set it in a Pyrex dish and put a few inches of water in it. And um, I'll just leave it there for a couple hours and see how much it drinks. But it felt, the pot felt light despite it being such a large cactus. And um, that's a good way with watering any plants. If you pick up a plant and it feels light, it means the soil is dry. So I'm gonna give this a try and we'll see how it goes. Meanwhile, aren't they cute? These are a couple of my new cacti and they're gonna enjoy some breeze and sunshine. It's about 60 two today during the day so it's warm enough for them to be out here for a little while and I probably won't keep them out too long I don't want them to get sunburned maybe half a day so I will check back in in a couple hours and we'll see how much this plant drinks right now it is a full Pyrex pan Okay, so here we are a couple hours later, and it looks like the golden barrel has drunk about almost half of the water. It's gone down a good inch and a half. I hope you can see that on film. But that was one thirsty cactus. So, um, you know, in nature, when there's a big rainstorm, all the desert cacti quickly soak up all that water and store it, um, especially, you know, cylindrical ones and barrel type cactus. They have a very fast way of, of wicking up that water into their water reserves. So I think that's what's happened here. Um, I feel like that poor little cactus or big cactus hasn't had a, a really big drink in a long time. So this should give it a good start to the growing season. And um, I will be bringing it inside and outside for the next week or two, and then it will go up into the polytunnel. But there you go, guys. There's a bottom watering example for you. And um, I think that's a good way to do it when there's so little space around the cactus itself. I would actually repot it up just a little bit if I had a pot. But right now we're sheltered in place, so I can't get a new pot. But hopefully later in the summer, that'll be happening as well. And um, maybe it's happier having less dirt around its roots. It does like to dry out after all. But thanks for tuning in and thanks so much for watching and subscribing. I hope you all are doing well and keeping busy with your plants. Bye.